Right now, I'm going to solve a differential equation. So this is uh, d cubed y dx cubed minus 4 d squared y dx squared plus 5 dy dx minus 2 y, which is equals to 0. And then uh, first of all, so referring to the previous video, I will convert this uh, third order homogeneous linear differential equation into a characteristic polynomial. So it becomes lambda cubed minus 4 lambda squared plus 5 lambda minus 2, which is 0. And then the next step would be to factorize this characteristics polynomial. All right. And then I know that lambda would be 1, 1, and 2. And then I will call this 2 a simple root. And then these two ones, I will call them double root. And then referring to the first bullet point here, if lambda, that means that 2 is a simple root, then I would have e to the power of 2x because this lambda is a 2. All right, and then um, we may need to multiply by a constant, and then this constant can be determined by the initial conditions if we are given in the questions. So maybe I multiplied it by a constant c. All right, and then I will uh, here we got the double root, and so referring to here, then um, we will have two more like close form of y. The first one would be e to the power of lambda x. This lambda is one, so I will have e to the power of x. And then I will also have x e to the power of 1x, all right? And then they're closed form of y, and then I still need to multiply by a constant. Maybe I multiply them by a and b, all right? So uh, then y would be these adding up together. That means right now I'm asking you to solve this differential equation. And then this is the general solution to this differential equation. And if I give you the initial conditions in solving this, then you are able to determine the A, B, C here. So right now we are going to go through the, the third point of um, the third bullet point here. So it said that more generally, if uh, lambda is the root of order R, so um, maybe we forget about this example and I write you another one. So if when you're doing your factorizations, you got something like uh, lambda minus uh, 2 to the power of 3, and then you have lambda minus 1 is 0. Then you would have lambda is 2, 2, 2, 1, right? So these two are a root of order 3, because you got three twos here. Then what you would have is e to the power of 2x corresponding to the first two, and then you will have x e to the power of 2x corresponding to the second two, and then you will have x squared e to the power of 2x corresponding to this two. So that this is essentially what is written here. And then for this one, since this is a simple root, then you will have e to the power of 1x, all right, without any x in front of it. And then uh, you still need to multiply by a constant. Maybe I multiply them by maybe a, b, C, D. So A, B, C, D are constant, and then this is the Y, and then I add them up, all right? So this Y would be the solutions to the differential equation with this as the characteristics polynomial.